With the new year brings resolutions, and for a lot of people, getting back in the gym is a common one. MTN's Annie Johnson joins us with how gyms are preparing for the new year's rush, or if there will even be one this year. Happy New Year! If you go to the gym regularly, then you know what this time of year typically means. Usually a lot more people. But what about during a pandemic? What's the New Year rush going to look like this year? Gym in January is definitely busier. And that's a big time. That's a big time for everyone when they make those New Year's resolutions and they want to make physical changes. It brings everyone back into the gym after New Year's. Which usually doesn't raise any eyebrows. But this isn't necessarily the time where you'd want to see crowded places. But one bell Great Jim believes the natural effect of the pandemic has fixed that. You lose people, you gain people. It stays about even all year. But of course, many local gyms are anticipating some new faces with the new year. Obviously, I hope everyone that is new coming into the gyms keeps up the standards and the protocols that we've been following as far as the uh, COVID procedures. But unlike previous years, gyms may start to see familiar faces coming back as well. I'm getting a lot of return get, uh, members that when COVID hit, they cancel their membership. Now they're all starting to come back. People aren't as afraid as they were before. As far as cleaning, both gyms say they plan on continuing what has been working and maintaining a clean facility. We put yellow rags out and, and spray bottles. Everybody grabs their own. We also put hand sanitizers in three areas of the room. We spread it out the equipment to where we're six feet apart. And then we also add it in to where you work out on one machine until you're done, then you clean it, you leave it. But if you're still not comfortable going to the gym, there's other options. All for it. If, if you want to stay away and work out at home and do your stuff, that you know, there's plenty of stuff that you can do at home and still get a good lift in. No one knows what the future will hold or what tomorrow might bring, but health officials still urge everyone to continue following those safety guidelines. Reporting in Bozeman, Annie Johnson, MTN News.